hey hi guys this is nitin pawar welcome to my channel in my last video i tried to cover the slowly changing dimensions uh, if you want to know those videos i already prepared them uh, you can go to the detail testing tutorial first in my first video i tried to cover the data, what data warehousing architectures and then type for five tone dimensions and then dimensional modings star schema snowflake schema and in my fourth video try to cover the slowly changing dimensions and in this video i'm trying to cover the what are the different scenarios you might want to consider while preparing the test cases how you want to test those things so first of all like whenever like you join the project and the on the etl sides you need to go through that project documents and try to understand the project architectures what are the source systems what are the target systems what are the etl tool use how the data is flowing from source to the target what are the conditions applied over there in source and target what are the source systems is it on the sftp server or normally just you are getting the files from the source systems and you are moving to the target what are the target is it a target like on the file system or on the database how many tables are there what are the table structures what kind of database they are using and uh, different types of things again then you want to know that what are the different environments are there there might be dev test u18 prod so dev do you get the only access to the test or u18 or prod or your responsibility is only for the test and u18 or is it only responsible for the test environment that again like when i say that environment details it means that what are the tools used on that environment how many like people are there who will be using those environment is it solely the test teams or the dev will also use those environment then like for defect logging what tools you are using are you using the hp alm like or jira where you are tracking all those things or devops then you need to work on the uh, you need to start preparing the test cases so how you start preparing the test cases for them then firstly you need to know that source systems so your source might have the naming convention that this particular source should have the date column in the end based on that that tool will pick it up so you need to validate that if you're not that file systems are not in the proper format then it should get filled then you need to know that uh, whether the source whenever you run the etl jobs or again then you need to validate those you need to write down the test cases for the job failure and the job successful validate the jobs then check that whenever you run the files etl job the etl job will pick up the data from your file source put it out to your target in that you should validate that whether the job runs successfully or not you need to check the source count suppose while loading the job etl job your source have 100 records but in target 80 records got loaded 20 records rejected but you need to know that whether those 20 records are valid reject or not means you have the business requirement with you you know that based on some conditions that okay that results records are getting rejected suppose i'm just giving an example there is a like column or like location they want to know about only india 